linking the unlinking revolutionizing access to internet for rural and urban communities. Assalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh. Honorable Justice on Pemilihan Mahasiswa Universitasi 2023, ladies and gentlemen. I'm Sidi Perjahyanto, Mahasiswa Universitasi, Diploma Program of Universitas Gajah Mada, and I'm thrilled to be sharing about my informative speed with you. Today, we are going to give it a topic that close to my heart. Digital Divide and How Article Internet Access of the Black in Rural and Urban Areas. Well, it's fun way with the limited internet access impact our communities, especially in rural areas. Ladies and gentlemen, Indonesia, as the world of the largest country in the world, facing a significant challenge in the trouble of internet and network infrastructure, this is having a large population and a rapidly growing the economy, it's a network problem in Indonesia, an obstacle to digitalization. According to a report from the Association of Indonesian Internet Central Provider in 2020, internet penetration in Indonesia has reached 73.7% or one with 196 million people. However, the quality of internet network in Indonesia is just not meet the expected standard. This included a factor such as the internet speed, reliability, affordability, and availability of governance. This digital divide within the villages and cities was a significant challenge in achieving the sustainable development goals number 9 about the industry, innovation and infrastructure, and number 11 about the sustainable cities and communities. In an effort to accelerate the implementation of smart city and smart country, Indonesia still faced in several challenges, although several cities in Indonesia, such as in Jakarta, Surabaya, and Bandung, have a proclaimed themselves as a smart city. This implementation is still not optimal. According to a report from the BBC in 2021, several obstacles in implementing smart HD and smart coaching in Asia is including flat investment, layout local technology development, and layout coordination between the government, private sector, and the community. Until 2020, the government and the Ministry of Communication and Informative has reached around 514,000 km of fiber optic took out in Indonesia and increasing internet access from the 4,000 villages in 2014 and 46,000 villages in 2020. However, this brother has not fully succeeded in achieving his goal because there are still many areas are difficult to reach by the internet network. Therefore, there is a need to constant solution that can be taken to improving internet and network access to all in Indonesia. Considering the fact of the internet access can contribute about the economic growth by up to stick for percent in advanced economic GDP and that the risk based internet access in Indonesia should be accommodated because it can lead to a sustainable development by increasing the efficiency of public service and accelerating about a social to more sustainable economy. To address this issue, I would like to recommend our several solutions. First, the Carson solution to accelerate the development of internet infrastructure in a remote and rural area that it can be done by building of internet network by a satellite and using a 5G coverage by utilizing blockchain technology. And the government can collaborate with the technology company to develop this solution with a short term goal is improving access in other several areas. And this can be told so the coming for program of the internet infrastructure development. And the second solution is about to improving about the human resource management and support about the development of internet infrastructure. The government can collaborate with the private company to CSR program. In the short term solution can include about the providing a training and certification program for internet infrastructure expert, which can be supported by any technology company such as Huawei, Microsoft, and Google. Meanwhile, in the long term, the government can work with this company to provide about the investment opportunity for internet that we can accelerate about the development of internet in those areas. And the third solution, it is about the improving internet infrastructure in Indonesia to be a smarter and more integrated smart city and smart country. To accept this, the government can work together with the NGO, such as the Indonesian Smart City Institute or Indonesian ICT Society to promote and develop the concept of smart city and smart country. With innovative solutions like by the internet engineering technology, it is hoped that the disparity internet between access of the village and the city become lower. So, the people in our region of Indonesia can enjoy the benefit of the technological advance and improving their quality of life also accelerate digitalization in Indonesia. Thank you. Wassalamualaikum warahmatullahi wabarakatuh.